four, three. All right, cool. <clears throat> Hello, welcome back. This is Ninja Maker. I'm back at it again with the gaming. Let's play some Capcom Arcade Second Stadium. Uh, I remember seeing the trailer of this game uh, uh, a few months back, and they have these two games that I love to play back in the day. It was um, Mega Man uh, Power Fighters and Mega Man 2. The, oh, no, it was uh, Mega Man The Power Battle and then Mega Man 2 The Power Fighter. I remember playing them for the Mega Man Anniversary Collection back in like 2004 on the PS2. Oh my god, I remember my younger brother and my niece we were like playing those two games hours on end. Like those two games are fucking addictive. So I'm kind of excited to play these two games again. And just like you no, know, I played of uh, uh, Capcom Arcade Second Stadium just to get the gist of it, um, get the settings the way I want it to be. So if you see some uh, some settings here and there, how why the screen looks like this, why the numbers look like that, that's why. <laughs> Let's jump into it. It's a pretty cute artwork. Re engine. Auto save feature. This beat is heat though, not gonna lie. Yeah. Oh, wait, hold on. Uh, some features are not available during. Wait. Well, what features are you talking about? I should read. Oh, okay, I think it's because of that castle uh story thing, so <sighs> I don't know, maybe I'll switch back to online mode. Uh it'll automatically pick me out. Fuck it. Yeah. What information get notification? Yeah, sure why not. Alrighty. Go to the playable one. Obviously, I'm gonna start with the first Mega Man theme. Mega Man The Power Battles. Uh, kind of excited to play this. Uh, game setting. Uh, start at medium. I don't want to kill myself. One more attack zone move. Hold on. Okay. Display setting. I mean, my super. Just, um... Hold on. Back. Yes, I know. Display orientation. Filter. Do I want to see the crispy filter or the soft filter? I'll go with the soft filter because I don't want to strain my eyes. <laughs> yes, please. 
to start game. Insert coin. So we have three of these dudes to pick. Mega Man, Proto Man, and Bath. Obviously, a Mega Man is like a go-to character. Shit! Yeah. Okay, yeah. <clears throat> Uh, Mega Man, he's like your go-to character. Proto Man is pretty much like the um the difficult character to play. And then Bass, he's pretty much like kind of like similar to Mega Man, but he's more hard to use. But Proto Man, he's the hardest to use. Bass is the second to the hardest. That's what I meant. I'm going with Proto Man. I would say I'm going to do like a full playthrough, do one through seven. All right, what's this man? Guts, man. Oh, I love that song quality, dude. Let's go. That sound quality. Oh, my God. Oh shit! I forgot to set the controller settings. Uh, whoa. Oh, what's wrong with me? Okay, um, confirm. Rapid fire. That. Don't be. Change weapon. R. Uh, rewind. Beat down. I'll do this. Uh, I'll do this. R. There we go. Okay, there we go. Alrighty, cool. We're good now. There we go. Yeah, that's how I want it to be. Rock my world. Oh. Gotcha. I just rocked his world. Hmm. You got a new weapon. Super arm. So obviously... Is very prone to how it usually plays in the original Mega Man franchise, which is pretty much like a, a boss rush. Uh, Woodman. So, uh, have you ever played like Cuphead or Contra or whatever? This is pretty much like right up your alley. Leaf Shield. Let's use the weapon. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, I'm all out of frogs. This kind of reminds me of Jurassic Park in a way. You can leave shield. Okay, so that. Obviously, you can stop the cursor, you press the button, but I'm just gonna let the game choose for me. Crash, man. <laughs> uh, 
boo. Am I just gonna do this with the portal buster? Probably. I mean, if I'm feeling rather self-indulgent, I'll use the other weapons. Scissors man. I'm gonna cut you down. Cut you down to size. Yeah. Whoa. Ow. Like some bosses, all they do is just jump and attack. Jump and attack. Obviously, there are some rare ones that just like run, jump, and attack. Just make a beeline towards you, crash into you, jump to the attack. <laughs> yeah. Come on. <clears throat> Whoa. Shit. Why oh, they come back? Uh, boomerang physics. Shit. Oh, shit. Oh, man. Oh yeah, see those two balls down there where it says bonus? That's pretty much like a uh, way to fill back your health. So you get like two health points back. Got rolling cutter. Got two more. This is heat man. Even after all these years, memory still serves. <laughs> And the more you, the more bosses you kill, the more difficult the other ones are. Like, oh my god. Like, if you look at the health down there, the health is much more longer than the previous boss. Jet. Holy shit. And it gets much more difficult. Ah. Okay. Oh yeah, if your health is that danger, you pretty much like get like a mega boost, and I'm dead. Okay, take it with Porter, man. Pretty much my favorite character in the game. Oh yeah, you definitely see the difficulty here. Oh. Man. <laughs> that animation though. Oh yeah, can I do a super jump? No, I can't. Well, I kinda do. Like if you hold up while jumping at the same time, you do a super jump. Raining snowflakes. Yeah. 
So far, the music is okay. It's just, it's kind of low. I mean, well, that's what you expect from a very old classic arcade. Die, die. I just put you on ice. Alright, now we go to Wily's Castle. Ice Slash. <laughs> the Yellow Devil. Let's go. Like, every time I hear the, the music in this kind of quality, I can't help but think about the Mega Drive. Because the Mega Drive, aka the Sega Genesis, has this same quality as well. Ow. Come on. Yeah, definitely Mega Drive esque. Shit! Whoa. I... This again? Oh, okay. Just turn himself into a literal ball. Night. All right. Nice fight. Let's go, Wiley. Oh, he's throwing hands at me. Mashing like crazy. Throwing hands again. Second four. All right, he's a thunder god now. Beat him. Gotcha. Get on our knees and suck my proto dick. Oh, not bad for a first try. This is proto man's ending. Is he? What a man, Dr. Light's first ever built program. Robot. What's the one? Ah. For me, uh, from time to time, mysteriously. Is he a friend or a foe? Or is he off? Nobody knows. Yeah, you have to speed read that shit. Yeah, obviously, uh, arcade games uh, back in the 80s and 90s. I mean, the Texas, the dialogues were very fast. You had to speed read that shit. I mean, arcade game was back then was like, hey, you better read this quick, motherfucker. Because we're here to, we're here to make you enjoy the game, not read. 
Alright, on to the other one. To go with the proto dude. Pretty sick. Gyro man. Sniped his ass. Gyro attack. Nate Paul, man. Yep. This boss looks pretty cool. Like one of the coolest balls. Or should I say, one of the coolest robot masters in the original Mega Man series. Palm bomb. I think that rhymes. Magnet man. Yep. I told you. That superb memory that I got. Oh yeah, this dude just jumps. Magnetize, choose magnets, and then just hop around like a freaking bunny. Obviously, one of the, the difficult boss fights. Oh my god. Using freaking instant transmission. Shit! It was pulling me in. It was sucking me in. Kind of annoying. Magnet missile. All right, Gemini man. with a zodiac sign here. I actually know a few Gemini's, but yeah. <laughs> oh. 
just running around. One of the most unique boss fights. Gemini laser. I just got hit by a freaking laser. Flat man. I actually kind of hate this boss. God, it's like Woodman's cousin. Like Woodman's gay cousin. No offense. Barrier. No plant. Come on. <clears throat> okay. Uh, wasn't doing so hot there. Barrier. Dust man? Yeah. The animation is game is pretty awesome for its time. Wrong way. Ugh. Yeah, like I said, if you're close to death, you get like a super boost of strength. On to Wily's Fortress once more. Just crack here. I'm on my way. Alright, Yellow Devil once more. Why do you keep jumping? Okay. Now there's a small yellow devil. I can multiply. No giant little devil. 
Can I keep jumping? Okay, that was kind of difficult. Yeah, this is um real shit show. Yep, yep, yep. Yeah, we already know the ending. We already know the ending. Alright. One more playthrough of this. Mega Man 7. Hey, man. Durakira man. Crash noise. Turbo man. Oh. Junk man. Uh, I just got one wrong. I'm like video.
Junk shield. This junk is probably not a good shield, right? <laughs> Flash man. Pretty much Wolverine man. Let's go, bub. I'm pretty sure it's like inspired by Wolverine. Like, come on. Uh, Wolverine back in the 90s was was a very popular Marvel character. lag sound effect though burning wheel yeah the sound effects was like super delayed there that was all in game freeze man Because uh, when Iceman was here, they were using Freeman's Freeze Man stage. But when you're playing Freeze Man, they use Gemini Man stage. But what is that nonsense there? Okay, I'm just gonna go ahead and slash you.
pretty much looks like a freaking thunder robot. Under strike. Yeah. Like I was saying. Different boss this time. I don't know what this robot called, but I'm just gonna go call him pumpkin head. <laughs> What's going on with you right now? Down in this game. Shit. Colors. You're a bit too close. You're a bit too close. Just got flicked. I'm just gonna keep him out. Yeah, fuck that.
Nobody knows. All right. There you guys. See, see the four credits here? This music is too calm. <laughs> settings how they are now you know what that mm. so was pretty much like one of the best ones and oh my god that sound quality 100 times more better than the first one look at that Listen to that goodness there. Let's jump into this magnificent shit. It's terrible. Probably all this boss too. It must be stopped. I mean, it's enough. You are needed. Like I said, you gotta speed read that shit. Oh yeah, so kind of different from the first one. You can actually choose which ball you want to rumble with. And like the second one, you oh, uh, uh, first one, like you can let the cursor choose for you randomly. But this one here, just let you choose right away. Let's see, I'm gonna go with Plant Man. So in this game, you actually have like cool super attack that every single person gets. Yeah, I don't know if you saw from the intro scene, you actually have a brand new character named Duo from Mega Man 8 that you can play. I just wrecked this shit. As you can tell from the intro screen, 
you have a the dude named Duo from Mega Man 8. Like he's one of the new characters that you can play. He's pretty new, unique too. But I remember I used to try him back in the day. He was just like super weird to use. But like, obviously he uses his fist to shoot people. And then he has like a a really neat attack that he can do. But if you want to look up how he does it, you can go ahead and uh, look it up on YouTube or whatever. <laughs> Oh yeah, that's one of the unique attacks that uh, was introduced in this game. You just have to uh, wait until you're fully charged and hold up. And then you do that. Oh yeah, you have this little buddy right here named Eddie to give you like special items that you can use. But there was no need for that because I just beat the shit out of this dude. I'm going to say bubble lead. Okay. Heat man. Obviously, they used some of the uh, boss characters from the previous one into this game. And then they introduced new ones. And this game is like much more user friendly than the previous one. Oh my god. Like, obviously, the majority of the bosses in this game, they just don't like jump and attack. I mean, they do, but there are times where they just like walk up. Come on. Oh yeah, as soon as you beat the boss and you see like a blue orb, you have to get the orb. If you're playing this on like two players, like both of you guys, I pretty much have to like fight to get that blue orb. In the previous versions, like if you beat the boss, both of you uh, get like the, the boss's power. But this one, you have to fight for that shit. <laughs> uh, Ready? Yeah, it was like charging right at me. Out. Nope. Shit, I thought I could stop him. Hmm. I got some from if he thinks of charging at me again. <sighs> Come on, charge at me. Suck a dick. Gyro attack. Uh, okay. Shadow Man. It's like one of my all time favorite bosses because, in case you guys don't know, I absolutely love ninjas, as you can tell from my name. Absolutely fucking love ninjas. This dude is awesome. Shadow Man.
Bring out the frog. Oh. Do it. Oh my god. God. I think I might die. Yep. As soon as uh, Eddie gives you an item, you pretty much have like a super shield until that gauge up on the top left runs out. You're pretty much like immune to any attack whatsoever. Like every single character has like a unique ability that Eddie gives. Shadow Blade. Sure, man. Horseman. Hey, that stupid shield that he uses. He charges at me. This uh, version of the game, they utilize the voice more than the previous. Cheap him out. Okay, I don't have the shield anymore. Grinder from Mega Man 7. Yes, you can tell it's from Mega Man 7 based on the theme that's playing right now. Yeah. I kind of don't want to use that. I just want to do this fight fair and square. Run over me! Run over me again! Oh man, you're just trying to flatten me, aren't you? Man, that was kind of easy.
All right. Floating skull. I know it's called Wily Mission, but I just want to call it Floating Skull. Because it looks like a floating fucking skull. Bouncy balls. Shooting bouncy balls. That's not Oh, it's just shooting everything at me right now. Go for the cursor. Yeah. Stop him, or just get out of the way. <laughs> Hurry up. But yeah, as soon as time is up, you automatically lose your life. Okay, this again. Just teleporting like random spark. Listen, Proto Man, how do you feel? How is your body holding up? You don't have to say anything. I know how you suffer, Proto Man. Your energy system has acquired a terrible defect. Unless it is fixed, your body will. And only I can fix your body as I am your creator. Don't worry about my problem. I know my body better than anybody else. And remember, I'm unbeatable no matter what. That confidence though. Don't talk that way, Proto Man. The war is over. Let's live together and keep peace. That's not my style. I'll do it myself. I don't need anybody. Nice chatting with you, Doc. But I've got things to do. Later. What kind of things are you talking about? Proto Man, Proto Man, wait, you need to be repaired. Proto Man has a defect in this energy system. It must be fixed soon. What will happen to Proto Man's body? And where is Proto Man going? Oh man. Kind of reminds me of myself. Guys, you know, I can be stubborn sometimes. Jesus. You have to know your limits, dude. Get those credits. Let's do it once more. So, yeah, like I said, uh, Duo is the uh, new dude in here. He plays very unique, but he's just one of those strange characters. Like, I, I couldn't use him. Okay, we did search for Wily. Now, on to rescue roll.
Holy shit, look at these dudes here. I was like going for cut, man. Like, he's like the first of my list. Gonna jump. Go. I. His voice, though. Wily what robot must have cannot roll. Hurry up and chase the Wily robot. Rolling cutter. Elect man. Come on. Ow. Ow. Under beam. Uh, I'm going to go with you, Vampire Man. Anguish the darkness. Hush noise. Funny, I'm just going for the little dudes first, and then going for the big dudes last. Wolverine man. Let's go, bub.
Uh, oh well. So. I'm stuck. He was just frozen right there. Last ball. Dive man, I think. Yeah, dive man. I just use one weapon. Oh, go ahead. <laughs> I was wondering, you're underwater, right? How can you possibly use thunder underwater? This voice actor died, man. Die, my dog. Like, he sounds so dedicated in the voice acting guy, man. <laughs> I've missed a side. Ooh. There you are, roll. You're safe, me, poor man. You're always there to save me. Pulling energy from the Wily robot. This will enhance your power. Okay. Now when it happens, it almost like it gives you like a supercharge for your charge attack. And we have dive missile. Got stone man. See that? Holy shit. Pretty strong. I'm sorry, did you say Power Stone? Did you say another Capcom game? <laughs> yep, he just said another Capcom game. Oh my god, that was almost a joke because I got that super charge in the back. Onto Wily's fortress once more. Power Stone.
Uh, yellow devil once more. Let's go. I don't know what he's saying. He's saying power strike? Oh, it's like... So it's to a ball. Oh my god. Just wreck this shit. <laughs> Alright, Wiley. Let's rumble a second time. I was going to say, can I cheap him out? Jumped right into my desk. Ah, uh, like a fucking dumbass. No, I don't need that item. Yeah, with a super charge attack, this boss was a joke. Alright, one more please. Pretty much the same ending as before, right? Yeah. Get this shit. Let's get this. Then put in my initials. Uh, let me check the game settings again. Can I check the game settings? Or I have to go all the way back. Uh, okay. Ready, let's do this. Recover the new parts. As soon as I see this dude right here, I just immediately want to go to him. I don't know why. Let's go, guts man. And he has a new walking animation now. He has a charge attack. I'm sorry. Was that a gamma charge? Hmm. 
Ruby in grave danger as the stolen powers are misused by Wily. Get back the parts at any cost. Super arm. Why not just call it rock toss? It's basically you're just fucking tossing a rock. Come on. Arrow man. This is a stage after all. I can tell by the background. They're shooting out yellow balls at me. Yeah. If he does that, don't attack. You just counter it. You'll be able to super jump. Yeah. Hit the lever up, the jump button to super jump. Be careful when using this new item. It's not completed yet. Basically, I just got a new mechanic super jump. I got Barrel Wave. Alrighty. Gemini Man. If he attacks, you attack when he does this. Yeah, I'll, I'll, I'll use that shield now. Oh. 
Oh. Oh, that's that quick charge. You gotta be really careful. Shit. Then you just stand there trying to look full and shit. Ah. Hey, poor man. <laughs> oh man! Actually, press the uh, the quick buttons. Ah. <laughs> Yep. Okay, here it Hey, Pom Pom. Looks like it's floating popcorn. <laughs> and then, obviously, you're going with Airman. Because I am an air sign. <laughs> going with Airman last. I'm sorry. I can wall jump there. Whoa. Controller. Okay. Air scooter. Ooh, facing the Mega Dragon from Mega Man 2. Or Mega Dragon. Yeah. Bringing out fire like a literal dragon. You realize that super jump. Oh, 
super jump. Okay. Let's go. Wait, you can fly? No. Jump good. Uh, I didn't want that shield. Power shot. Got mini dragons now. Burr. Trying to <laughs> shit. Okay. Last boss fight. I'm sorry. What was that? Putting out two balls now. What's got you down? Shit. Yo, that full fucking concentration that I had. Holy help out. Come on, let's do this. I took him out. You game. Fuck you. Oh. Ah. <laughs> uh. Alright, let's get this. Skip that, skip that, skip that, skip that. Skip that. Just gonna let the credits roll. But yeah. Like these two games still hold up. Like I'm kinda surprised that um like the eShop or any other like uh, game shop or whatever would like exclusively try and sell these games instead of like put them in, putting them in a bundle, you know? Because these two games are bangers. In my opinion, they're like Capcom bangers. And for them to just put them like in a bundle, an exclusive Capcom bundle, I can kind of understand that. But at the same time, it's like a missed opportunity, you know? I mean, just imagine the, the amount of money that they would make, like the amount of chump change that they could make if they just sell these games without like putting them in a bundle.
Oh, okay. Uh, I'm gonna go ahead and exit out of here. Oh man, my score went all the way up. But yeah, this is a really, uh, really decent uh, stadium or whatever you call it. Like, yeah, this is pretty cool. I mean, the only downside is that they don't have the uh, the online co-op. I mean, that's what's missing from it. Like, I'm pretty sure it was missing from the first one. They didn't add it to the second one. Like, why? Why didn't I do that? I mean, why just do it locally? Why not just do it locally and online? Like, it would make much more sense that way. Like, Capcom, if you're listening, like, take some notes. Like, if you release another update, please, please put in the online co-op. Like, it will get a lot more players into a lot more like get a lot more games into this one yeah that was that was kind of fun that was nostalgically fun it was challenging and fun <laughs> but yeah but i just hope that really is like an update like that's coming out real soon in order to put like the online co-op on here like i'm just hoping i'm crossing my fingers that they put that shit on there like oh my god like if they were to put that on there i would make another video like not gonna lie but uh yeah definitely brought like the lovely memories of playing this game in the anniversary collection PS2 version. It was really awesome. Super awesome. Like I can definitely tell like there is um a huge replay value of this. If you wanna get like the top score or whatever, and if you wanna showboat your scores around the world whatsoever. Yeah. Alright, I'm gonna end it here. All right, this is Ninja Maker once more. Thank you very much for watching this uh, playthrough of Capcom Arcade Second Stadium. Thank you very much for watching my playthrough of Mega Man The Power Battles and Mega Man 2 The Power Fighters. Until next time.